And here we come. Swimming in lane one with St. Charles, Ethan McMillan, lane two with UTCSLB Swim Club, Devin Dillinger. Lane three with Long Island Aquatic, Eduardo Santana. Lane five with Patriot Aquatic, Jaden Highland. Lane six with Nova Virginia, Craig Bowman. Lane seven with Rockville Montgomery, Fletcher Bouts. Lane eight with Kansas City, Graydon Peoples. And your top seed in lane four with Great Lakes, Ben Davis. Okay, so you see your top seed there, Ben Davis in the center of the pool. And we talked about the Great Lakes Sailfish team. Uh, Bill Bear down here coaching them up this week. Our, our number one seed, Ben Davis, as I started to mention earlier, because I was on the wrong heat, was out in 52-9. He won the 100 free last night. It looks like he's going to aggressively jump out and get the lead early today. Yep, he's, he's definitely got his turnover working. He's going to be slightly ahead of Craig Bowman, who's over in six from Nova. Ben's split is 25-5-4. He's seven-tenths ahead of his nearest competitor. A full second and a half faster than he went out this morning, too. A second and a half and a 50. Maybe he was holding back <laughs> a little bit. He might have been. He just might have been. I guess if you know. I was well back, but he wasn't. This is going to hurt. Yeah, yeah. Well, he knew he was going to get a good yeah, lane. And here he is halfway through this one. 54-0-5. Yeah, right. Again, that's, uh, he just continued to expand, um, extend his lead. Uh, he's on 56-1 this morning. He's on 54 flat tonight. Well, you got to, you have a. A pretty solid crew out there, five and six. That's Jaden Heinlein and Craig Bowman. They're giving chase in three is Eduardo Santana. Two is Devin Dilger. Ben Davis continues. He's a 124-0 for 50 yards to go. And these guys, all of these guys are out significantly faster, as much as let's not gonna have to two seconds faster than they were this morning. But ben Davis has continued to keep the feet, at, uh, the entire heat at his feet, and building up that lead. He's still got a big kick, so apparently he didn't go out too fast. But look at lane three, uh, Eduardo Santana coming in quickly, closing, and oh. finishes in second place, touching out Jaden Heinland. 154-2 for the win, 55-7. There you go for Eduardo. 29-5, last 50. 